Hello! Welcome back to Adventure All The Way. I'm Emma and I'm a homeschooling mum of three in the UK and this is my first video after not back to school week and to be honest I'm exhausted. <laughs> I'm filming this on Sunday ready for you to see on Monday and I am all curled up in bed in my pyjamas with my big chunky jumper on and today we're going to do something a little bit different. We're not going to talk about homeschooling Apart from the fact that we are reviewing some products from a really great company that I really, really love. Um, she's a soul trader, she's a, she's a mum, and her business is called Green Queen Eco Products, and she's a homeschooling mum here in the UK. Uh, she's an old school friend of mine, a really, really good friend of mine, and I'm really excited to try some of her products. She's been... Um, like kind of on my radar for a while and I've been like oh I really want to try that oh I really want to try that and I've never actually done it so I said to her okay I've got 15 pounds I want you I'm going to give you 15 pounds and I want you to send me a random section of all the different products you do within that 15 pounds and I will review them and see what I like and see what I don't like and that sort of thing so this isn't a paid promotion, but the person is my friend, um, and so maybe I'm a little biased, but we'll see. I probably won't be biased about the stuff inside, because I'm usually pretty blunt, and um, as you might have seen from like my babe box reviews and stuff, like I don't, I don't sugarcoat stuff. If I like it, if I like it, if I don't, I don't. So, um, so I can't comment on the packaging of things because it was hand delivered to me, um, but and it was, and it's in a nice. It is in a. Um, paper bag so I can compost that which is nice. Now I'm just going to tip it all out and uh, then tilt you down so you can have a look, okay? Okay, you ready? Here it goes. Okay, so this was the first thing I actually asked for which were some makeup cleaning pads. Um, they're really really soft brush cotton on this side and like regular woven cotton on this side um, I use uh, pads like this for um, Washing my face like every day and I was realizing that I was going through So many of them every single day. I was like, well, it'd be nice to have some reusables and I can make them myself I am a seamstress. I do love sewing um, But I thought you know, I would support my friend's business and buy some they're really soft. They feel like a cushion I imagine they would feel really nice on my face. Uh, so the next thing we've got are some straws. We have some metal straws here, so some straight straws with a straw cleaning brush. And we do use metal straws already, but um, it's always really handy to have some more. And these things, like when they run out, I've got another one now, so. There's also some bamboo straws in here, which I've never ever tried before. I've never tried bamboo ones before, so it'll be really interesting um, to try those. They almost look like chopsticks, don't they? Like, I'd be really interested to try those in a drink. I might test them out tomorrow. <sighs> what else? What else? We've got this really cool spoon, which is really eager and it's nice and wood. It looks like bamboo again. Oops. Looks like bamboo again, and... Um, yeah, it's really smooth, nice smooth handle. And Phil's always complaining at me about not using metal utensils on the um, like the non-stick frying pan that we've got and stuff like that. So that would be really useful to have um, in the cupboards downstairs. What else have we got? We have got some travel soap here. And it says lemongrass, lavender, tea tree and peppermint. Free from parabens, plastic, SLS, palm oil, and cruelty. Well, that's always good. Oh, it like has that kind of natural look about it, doesn't it? Oh my god, it smells divine. Oh wow. I wish you could smell that, but it's really, really yummy. Uh, it's by it's by a, it's a sample by a company called Friendly Soap. I'm really excited about using that. What else have we got? We have got Fit Pit Woman Natural Deodorant Sample. I, oopsie. This smell really nice. So it just went really quiet then, didn't I? This smell really, really nice. It smells quite similar to the soap, actually. 
um, and I guess you just get a bit like this and then just like wipe it on your skin I'm not going to show you my armpit right now but I'm guessing you just do that like that on your skin like on your armpit you know, it would smell really nice I'm pretty sure that um, Carrie Ann, who's the lovely lady whose business is this, um, gave me the ingredients for this and it's essentially like essential oils and bicarbonate of soda and that's it. Um, there might be a few other things but yeah, it smells really good. Hmm, I should probably try that on a day when I'm doing horse riding or something so, um, so once I get all sweaty you can see if I uh, smell, still smell really yummy or not. So then we have this random brown packet um, for very similar random brown packets. It's like Christmas. Ooh, it's a bamboo toothbrush. It's an adult one. Little purple bristles there. Oh, and another adult one with rainbow bristles. I like that. That one's very cool. So I'm assuming these ones are going to be children's sized ones. There we go, look, it's a child size, sorry, a child size purple one. And, oh, and there's a child size pink one too. <laughs> so, I'm going to give these, I'm going to give one of these a test now. Uh, I think I will pick, hmm, I think this one has stiffer bristles, I think I'll pick the purple one because I have really sensitive gums, so I'm going to have this one. Okay, so we're in the bathroom, I've got my bamboo toothbrush and I have my cleansing wipes, my new cleansing wipes, I am going to give them a whirl. So I've never used a bamboo toothbrush before. I don't know if it's any different to using a plastic toothbrush. We will just give it a try. Oh, I think we're running out of toothpaste. That's not good. Okay. Hmm. So I'm really sensitive about different textures, especially in my mouth. And I found that this, when it was dry, it tasted, it felt really, really weird in my mouth. It was like, but as soon as I wetted it, it was fine. So I would recommend it. I think my children will like it more than I will. So the next one is using my simple cleansing lotion. I'm going to cleanse my face. Don't really take my glass. Nobody really sees me with my glasses off anymore, so you should count yourself super lucky. <laughs> Can't get out of the bottle. I think I might need some more. So the one thing I like about disposable pads is that you can see the dirt, and I know when it's clean because sometimes, like, you do it once and it's not clean. So let's go. Oh, that put a lot on one side of my face, didn't it? Oh, it's getting a bit stuck to my face. Oh, it's so big. I feel like maybe smaller ones would be better. Yeah. Oh god, I've got some in my hair. Yeah, these are a bit big for my taste, I think. Maybe ones that are like half the size would be better for me. That's not cool. I washed my hair this morning. Ow, sorry, I just hit you. I didn't mean to beat you up. So I'm gonna use the soft soap now to like wipe it all off. Yeah, I can't see whether like my face 
it's properly clean or not, which is a bit annoying. But I guess if you use like white cotton, oh no, I can a little bit. I suppose if you used white cotton rather than brushed cotton or, or padded cotton, you'd be able to see better. Yeah, my face doesn't feel any less clean. Getting some wrinkles. Yeah, I'd use them again. Use them again. Hmm. Let's see how it holds up with some toner. So again, I just use simple toner. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. So it doesn't soak in, it just fell straight off of my hands. Let's try the other side, the brush cotton side. Okay, the brush top cotton side works better. I can... It soaks in, so the non-brushed cotton side, the woven cotton side, it's pretty water resistant. And it rolled straight off onto my hand, but the brushed cotton side uh, it soaked in enough to be able to put it on my face. Oh, 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 I've got sleepy dust in my eye. Oh, yeah, these are a bit big, I think. I think they could do with being smaller. But that's fine. Hmm. Yeah, you can see that my face isn't clean. As a bit, you can't see. My face hasn't been cleaned properly by the cleanser the first time, because I didn't do it this morning, so my face is probably pretty gross. Um, but yeah, with the white, I think the white is definitely better. I think if I had them again, I would request only white ones. Hmm. It's definitely got a full coverage, but I feel like I got it in, like, in my face a bit. So I would definitely use these again, but I would pref I'd maybe look for, I'd maybe like ask for smaller ones, or I'd, but I'd definitely only ask for the white backed ones rather than the pink backed one, because then I can actually see that I've got everything, like I haven't missed a bit, if that makes sense. I have no idea where my glasses are. Has anyone seen them? Ah. There we go. I look really, I feel like I look really different with, that, with different, my glasses on. Okay. Let's go back to the bedroom. Be right, be right back. Oh, so, there we go. I have tested out some of the products. It doesn't, I don't feel like the cleansing wipes were quite for me. Um, I feel like if I could have them smaller, I would be happier, but I think they were really useful. I do think they would be really, really good for my children, like to encourage them to wash their face. Like you could get them nice and wet and they're just the right size for children's hands and children's faces. So I definitely would buy them again, but maybe I wouldn't use them for myself. I would use them for the children rather than like a massive flannel or something. Um, and I really like the toothbrush, I just feel like I have to make sure that I wet it before I use it because otherwise it just felt really weird in my mouth. But then again, I've also never used a bamboo toothbrush before, so I'm not entirely sure what I thought I was going to what it was going to be. I didn't know what I was going to expect. So yeah, I'm really excited to try out these bamboo straws tomorrow. So um, if you follow me on Instagram, I will show you me trying these out tomorrow. And I've tried out metal straws before and we really, we all collectively as a family really, really like them. Um, I definitely will get some of that soap, like order a, um, uh, order a full sized one of that soap because it smells amazing and it doesn't seem to upset my skin at all, which is a massive thing for me with all... Um, toiletry products, I have really really sensitive skin and I have eczema and the kids quite often get eczema as well so I have to be really really picky about the products we use but I would definitely take that soap, have that soap um, I would yeah, I would definitely have that soap more often, it's really cool so this has been my very quick but reasonably thorough review of the Green Queen Eco products um, I really really enjoyed trying out Carrie Ann's, um, Carrie Ann's products and I can't wait to order some more of the things that I really really love. Thanks for watching guys and I look forward to seeing you next week. Bye!